Hello, YouTube. So if you joined me last night, which not very many of you did, but if you did, you know that I wanted to go off campus and there were no parking spaces. So I just washed my car, kind of rinsed it off because the rain destroyed it. And I rinsed it off and I'm going to go out on an adventure to Target because their clearance rack the other day was amazing. So I'm taking you with me because I have nothing else to vlog about. Oh, I did realize though that Rebecca Black is very easy to karaoke your life to. As horrible as a song it is, but somebody actually sent me a message asking why I like that song so much. I really don't like that song. I actually really hate it. I hate that song to death, but it's so easy to make fun of. Like, driving, driving. I am now driving. Oh no, my camera! That's what I get for going on a hill. Ugh, I'm going to die. It's just, it's, it's, a, it's just a good song that you can make fun of. Not so much that... Not so much that it's even a good song, it's just that it's so easy to make fun of. So, that's why I like that song. If, if you can even qualify that as liking it, which I don't know if you can, I think it's more of just, I like to make fun of it. So, I don't really have anything to vlog about right now, so I think I might stop this nonsense for a little bit until I get to Target. So I'm approaching Target right now, and as I am driving, I've discovered something quite marvelous. I left milk in here from Saturday. That's chocolate milk from Saturday. That's disgusting. I am glad I didn't drink it. Uh, I'm in the Target parking lot. I'm almost hit somebody. I shouldn't be videoing while I'm driving. So I am on the Target escalator right now with my janky milk in hands. I can throw it away. And as I approach the top, I will probably shut this off because last time I came to Target with a the camera, they made me put it away. So I have to be very slight with this. Well, that was a slight waste because they didn't have anything that was worth mentioning in their clearance rack. I have an hour and 15 minutes until work. I'm debating if that is worth it to drive to Ross. Because I really want some more clothes. It's like, it's getting to that time where I'm kind of like bored of the clothes that I already have. And it'd be so nice to have some more clothes. Because I'm wear I feel like I'm wearing the same things like every day. You ever feel like that? You're just like wearing the same stuff all the time. And Target had some really, really good clearance stuff the other day. Like they had $4 really nice shirts and they're all gone now. I don't want to get weird looks from people. I'm in like a super sketchy city. I think I've said that like in just about every video that I've made that involves me talking about this city, but it's super sketch. So, I don't want to get weird looks because you never know when you're going to get shot. Oh crap. Traffic. Do not honk at me. Do not honk at me, dude. Oh no. If you were going to ride me, I'm going to break. Jerk. I gotta deal with this. Hold on. I really, really dislike when people ride me. Like, it's just, it's not even nice. Like, I don't do it to people. Why should they do it to me? And like, the guy was turning. He had no reason to be riding me. Like, me going faster was gonna help him get into his turn lane quicker. I hope he gets into an accident. But doesn't get hurt. It's just an accident. I like driving, but I hate stupid drivers that make turns that they shouldn't do, like what this guy's doing in front of me right now. I would show you, but I think it's illegal to show license plates on the internet. I don't know. That's just a thought. I have arrived at Kohl's, and there's a police officer outside the front door in his car. I'm wondering if that means something bad, which means I should probably be very careful with my camera because if I put it back in my pocket all suspicious like, it may look like I stole something, which I'm not planning on doing today or ever in my lifetime. So I'm going to be careful with recording things so I don't know if I'll actually get anything in here. I don't think there's really that much to record inside of Kohl's, but if I find something really earth shattering, I promise I'll record it. Or I'll take a picture of it at the very least. But here we go. I wonder if this is a sign from God that I'm not supposed to have any nice things because everything that I liked was $24.99 and everything that was cheap was ugly. 
and they didn't take any pictures because there was like nobody in there and the cameras were like I feel like they were watching me and I always feel guilty like videoing in, the, in, in any kind of store because I feel like they're gonna like run up to me and like I'm gonna put my camera away and they're gonna think I'm stealing something so there's got to be somewhere in this world that has nice clothes that don't cost $24.99 and I have half an hour until work. So I'm debating checking one more place. I'm gonna do it. Let's go. You know, as I wait for this light to turn green, and as it's turning green right now, I really don't know if I want to go to another store. I think I am just going to cut my losses, which was the gas that I spent to drive around, and eat something before work and get clothes another day when they might be cheaper. So I feel like maybe I just went out on a bad day. Because when I went out on Saturday, Friday, whatever that was, I think it was Friday, there were some really good deals at Target. And today there was nothing. And I didn't try the other places, but probably there were good deals at other places too. But there were no good deals at today. So I feel like if I checked Kohl's, they usually have pretty good deals there for stuff. I feel like if I check Kohl's, then probably Ross isn't going to have much better deals. So, and Ross is usually a lot more ghetto. I think I'm missing my exit here. Uh-oh. Kill myself here. Um, so, I think I'm just going to cut my losses, and I am not going to go to Ross. But, thank you for following me around on this adventure, and hopefully there's a parking space for me when I get back to school. So I am pulling into my parking structure now, or my park. Ah, oh, horse! Someone stole my spot. Ah, oh, no thieves. Okay. Well, I was pulling into my apartment, and someone has stolen my spot. Thieves! And they even parked the wrong way. Okay. Well, I might just have to go. Oh look. Again, thank you for joining me on my extremely random, pointless adventure that ended up resulting in nothing. But it's okay because I got to go out again. I have 20 minutes to work. So, with that, I will talk to you guys later.